All right, one sec, Kyle, one sec. Dude, take the photo, man. I'm feeling stupid. <laughs> Go. Yo, 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 so you see that big bulging part of the tricep? That's the lateral head and that's the head we're gonna be targeting slash talking about today. So we're gonna start off, this is one of my favorite exercises and this is what I generally start my tricep routine with. It's a tricep dip and you can do them on a bench, you can do them weighted, whatever you prefer, but we're just doing a basic tricep dip here. So a few tips to remember, so you're gonna wanna lean into the tricep dip just a little bit, but you should keep your body more upright than a chest dip. For those of you who've tried that, that's just a dip that targets the chest. We'll talk about that another time. So most importantly, you don't wanna go lower than when your arms are parallel to the floor on a tricep focused dip, um, which is what we're doing here. And your elbows don't need to flare out for this exercise. Uh, you're gonna to wanna to stop short of going deep because that's the range of motion where the pecs are engaged and we're actually working the triceps, as you guys know. Uh, so you're gonna to wanna to perform the positive part of the rep and go all the way to the top. You're gonna to wanna to perform full range of motion and feel a nice contraction action on the triceps. So now we're gonna jump into the straight bar tricep pushdown. So for those of you who saw our last video, we actually did this with a, uh, with a supinated form, and that was to target the medial head of the triceps. I'm gonna toss a card right here so you guys can check that out if you haven't seen it already. So here, um, this is the straight bar variation with our hands pronated. Um, so this is gonna put great emphasis on the lateral and long head of the triceps. Um, and you know a little bit of emphasis on the medial. It's gonna put less emphasis on the medial than uh, the last exercise we did in the last video. So generally we like to do about eight to 12 reps, three sets, that's how we usually like to do it, just in the hypertrophy range. So now we're gonna move on to the dumbbell skull crusher. Um, we also have a video on this on why we decide to do dumbbells rather than barbells. Well, I'll toss a card in, the, um, in this video. So this is an exercise that's gonna position your hands at an in-between position perpendicular to your body. So this is actually gonna focus on the lateral as well as the long head. So, you know, it's not very common for you to find too many lateral focused exercises that aren't gonna bring in either the long or the, uh, the medial head into the exercise. So that's why I showed you ones that will target a few other ones. So just a side note, we're using this weight for demonstration purposes, it's not actually what we use. And here's a bonus one, this is actually gonna stress all three heads of the triceps. Um, this is you know a huge one that we use as an ender, we just rip it out and we do uh, drop sets, we'll do force reps and we do all that fun stuff. So thank you guys for checking in, hopefully you found this video informative and we'll see you in the next video. Peace, and don't forget to subscribe for some massive triceps and heavy deadlifts. We'll see you in the next video, guys, peace. You wanna make some gains? Out of the way. <laughs> what the heck is that? <laughs> he just got his watch Hodge twin. <laughs> oh, right, who are they? Call me hey.